checking back for part two of new rods and reels here at the warehouse. Up first is a few new rods from Lou's. This is the Lou's Tournament Series, which retails for $119.99 to $149.99 and is available in spinning and casting models. Both rods feature Lou's 60 million modulus graphite advanced performance technology. They also feature the Fuji Hardloy concept guides. They have a stainless steel Texas rig style bait keeper, premium cork on the fore and rear grip, and feature Fuji ECS reel seats with the exposed grip for added sensitivity, and all come with Lou's limited lifetime warranty. The next rod in the lineup is the Lou's Tournament Series Speed Sticks, which retail for $169.99 to $179.99, also available in casting and spinning models. The Tournament Pro features Lou's exclusive APT blank construction technology with 85 million modulus graphite and carbon fiber construction. Also utilizes Fuji K-Series guide alkanite inserts. This guy has the same stainless steel Texas rig hook keepers. Has e premium EVA foregrips and Fuji's ACS graphite reel seat with nice contour grip and exposed reel seat and the same EVA rear grip and split grip design. This rod also has a Lou's limited lifetime warranty. Up next is the Team Series Speed Stick, which retails for $219.99 to $249.99. This rod also features Lou's 85 million modulus graphite APT construction or advanced performance technology, blank construction with a carbon fiber. Has a Fuji stainless steel K-Series concept guides. This rod features the SIC inserts and has the same stainless steel Texas rigged baykeeper. Has a premium cork and carbon fiber winding chuck. The same Fuji ACS graphite reel seats with that contour design and feel through technology. And then also the, the premium cork continues on to the rear grip and has a split grip design with a premium cork and graphite carbon fiber construction. And like all the loose rods also comes with limited lifetime warranty. Up next is a Kuma Citrix rod. This rod retails for $119.99 and is available in casting and spinning versions. This rod is constructed with IM8 graphite, making it very lightweight and sensitive. It utilizes ALP stainless steel guides with zirconium inserts, making them compatible with braid. These have a standard stainless steel hook keeper on them and have a no foregrip design, making it so you can easily just put your finger on the rod and make it very sensitive. Has a custom anodized reel seat threads for good strength and balance when tightening down the reel. It also has a pack bay minimum reel seat for reduced weight. And you can see here it actually has what they call a floating reel seat design to where the reel sits above the blank, never contacting the blank and dampening the sensitivity of the rod. Has lightweight EVA split grip design all the way throughout the rod, making it very lightweight and comfortable. And with all Akuma rods, the Citrix is also backed by Akuma's limited lifetime warranty as well. Up next is the Abba Garcia Verdict which retails for $129.99 to $139.99. The Verdict features premium lightweight 36-ton graphite blank design, making it the highest grade graphite available in any Abu Garcia line. This rod also utilizes titanium alloy guides with SIC inserts. And you can see here it has that same Texas rigged hook keeper design. It has a one-piece double anodized aluminum screw down, making it very secure and also looks pretty cool on the reel as well. You can see it has the exposed blank here design with that same floating reel concept, a reel seat concept, allowing you to not to reduce any sensitivity in the rod. Has lightweight EVA, high density grips, making it very comfortable and durable. But the most unique feature on this rod is actually in the handle. What's really cool about this handle is you actually can just turn this handle counterclockwise to loosen it, and then you can shorten it up, and you tighten it back up again. What this allows you to do is when you're doing finesse techniques or top waters or jerk baits, now it's nice and short and you can work the rod without it getting in your way. But if you want to do power techniques or you want to make longer cast, simply loosen it up again. And now you can get two-handed cast or you can also tuck the, ro the rod in allowing you when you're using like a power technique. Thanks for checking out the new rods and reels here at Tackle Warehouse. Make sure to check back on Friday for some tips with Jared Lintner over at Lake Nacimento showing us how he likes to fish lakes to have spotted bass.